it's Christmas. This is my absolute favorite time of the year. In this video, I'm going to be showing you three last minute gift ideas for Christmas for your family and your loved ones. If you're a lastminute.com person like me, this video is for you. I've partnered with foodtrolley.com. It's an online grocery service that delivers groceries around Lagos and around Nigeria. In Lagos, they deliver for 500 Naira. They are absolutely affordable and DIY dose approved. So without wasting much time with this intro, let's get into it. So the first thing I did was to go on their website, foodtrolley.com. I just clicked everything I wanted and it was delivered to my house. The first last minute gift we're going to tackle is this gift hamper. This is very popular in Nigeria and I got the basket from Maryland where they leave it but you can always get it online. So I ended up with this silver basket and I got some red tool to represent the season. So what I did, I just took some scrap paper, I put it at the base and then I arranged all the things that I needed in descending order. The bigger things at the back and the smaller things in front. What I did next was to place the tool fabric on the floor and place the basket in the center and wrap it around the basket. I tied a bow at the top, added some extra ribbon and then pulled it with my scissors and cut off the excess fabric. Now this is one DIY I would love to give my brother. It looks like a candy jar but it has money hidden inside. So you need some money, skittles, toilet paper, a jar and some ribbon. So you take the to toilet paper roll and you roll some money into it and then you add the skittles around it so making sure that the, to the toilet paper paper thingy <laughs> is at the center i got this idea off of pinterest and it is so i love it so much i close the jar tie the bow i do the same thing pull it apart and kind of pull it with the scissors to give it those spirally curly things this next DIY can be done by someone who's not even crafty. All you need is a wine bottle, some organza fabric, and some wrapping paper. So what I did was I laid the shiny side down and wrapped the wrapping paper around the wine and then taped it off. What I do next is to wrap my organza fabric around the bottle and I use my trusty ribbon to kind of tie it and secure it in place and then I start to wrap the fabric around itself to kind of form a rose at the top. So what I do is, you see that string that is sticking out? I use it to secure it in place. And that's the end of my video. If you like this video, don't forget to leave a comment. What are you going to get your family and friends? And don't forget to use foodtrolley.com for your last new shop.